Hi, welcome back to another episode of Sopninga Letters Stream Together. In this video, we're going to talk about Mackie Mackie. Just before we're going to start with the video, I'm going to tell you a quick interesting fact. Did you know that Mackie Mackie is the second brightest object in the Kuiper belt after Pluto? The dwarf planet was discovered a few days before Easter on March 31st, 2005 by M. E. Brown, C. H. Truello and D. Rabonowitz at the Palomar Observatory. First, the planet was nicknamed Easter Bunny. When the astronomers who discovered it chose the official name, they decided to name it after the Rapunia god of fertility, Mackie Mackie, which is a mythological character from an island named Easter Island. Mackie Mackie is a dwarf planet. And like most of the objects in the solar system, it formed about 4.5 billion years ago. Mackie Mackie is also a member of a group of objects that orbit in a dislike zone beyond the orbit of Neptune. This zone in our solar system is called the Kuiper Belt and in it lies our dwarf planet for today's video. The dwarf planet's radius is approximately about 715 kilometers. It is about 45.8 astronomical units away from the sun. The sun, it takes the sunlight 6 hours and 20 minutes to reach Mackie Mackie. A day on Mackie Mackie is 22 and a half hours. And a year on Mackie Mackie is 305 Earth years. We still do not know much about Mackie Mackie's structure. We can't see too many details of Mackie Mackie's surface from so far away. But the dwarf planet does appear to be reddish brownish in color, similar to that of Pluto. Scientists have also detected frozen methane and ethane on its surface. In fact, pellets of frozen methane as big as one centimeter in diameter may rest on Mackie Mackie's cold surface. Mackie Mackie may develop a very thin atmosphere that is mostly made of nitrogen when the dwarf planet is near its perihelion, which is the point in its orbit when it is the nearest to the sun. The surface of Mackie Mackie is extremely cold, so it seems unlikely that life could exist there. Mackie Mackie so far has one provisional moon, and the moon is nicknamed MK2. It is more than 1,300 times fainter than Mackie Mackie. MK2 was seen approximately 13,000 miles from the dwarf planet and its radius is thought to be about 80 kilometers. There are no known rings around Mackie Mackie. We still don't know if Mackie Mackie has a magnetosphere. All the information that we get from Mackie Mackie is from ground-based telescopes from around the world. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share. And don't forget to write your comments in the comment section below. Signing off, show me.